airplane. More specifically to a particular person, you know who you are. I want to show this game, City Skylines. Pretty fun game, but it's very complicated for this particular person. So let's start a new game. I have some mod or DLC installed. You might not have all of the things that I have. So we have a bunch of maps that we want to choose. Now you wanted a particular we'll do um the plains one. Because that's probably where you you want to build your city. Particular person I refer to. I think it's just in the base game. Um, who is it? Not in the base game. Ooh, don't remember. There's a bunch of maps you can get. I don't own those. What am I doing? 
snowy, snowy. You know, I think the Dust Bowl's probably the most like it, but that's, that is a not a, um, a base game one. If you're playing base game without the DLC, I would say probably two rivers, because at least, you know, Alberta has two. Two rivers at least. But we'll play the Dust Bowl on mine because there's no no water whatsoever. Not really it's more like there's not really a plains plains one. Arid plains. I guess this yeah, okay. This is also <laughs> that but at least it's more planes like you know. okay so we'll start you have this bird friend that helps with you gives you tips informs you on what your city is feeling like your peeps your people All right, so when you first enter the game, you'll see it's pretty barren. You got this one square here of what you can deal with, but you can expand like far out into... Can I show you that? Yeah, you'll eventually get like more squares you can purchase that are adjacent to your tile. And I'll tell you right away that you need to build some roads because you need to build a city. Now, there's no really a particular way to do this. You just need to keep in mind, like, for future purposes, how you want your city to lay out. Um, because your highway is your only access into your city. So if you have a lot of intersections right here, it's going to clog it real. It's going to clog it up real fast. What I like to do is I like to put a roundabout here, but I unlock all the roads first by placing down some stuff. And I get my bulldozer so I can get the dirt road because the dirt road's cheap. You don't need, you don't need a fancy dancy road right off the bat. And I would just, uh, Build a big old roundabout. You know what? They tend the first entrance into your city tends to be pretty big. I want to make a big roundabout. We'll do um two hundred wide. Will I be able to get into there? This is a bit nuanced because I want there to be enough space where I can build roads. 200. 200. And then a cool thing about this, you can make curved roads. So you can do this, but I want to do it directly with my one way because I know I'm, I'm making a roundabout. I want it to be one singular direction. Um... As this is coming in, I want my direction to be like this. There we go. And now... Oh, I did crosswalks. Well, that's fine. And we'll do it so it kind of leans into the roundabout. And then this one... Same deal. There you go. Now you have a nice little roundabout going into your city. 
Now, it's not going to be big right off the bat, so we're just going to add a few things. But what we want to keep in mind is we want there to be like one big main road that branches off into a bunch of little roads. Because that way there's one road that has a lot of traffic and there's a bunch of little roads that only share a little bit of traffic. So, I'll just do, I'll just do a big old, big old line going down. We only have a certain amount of money, so we don't want to go overboard. We'll just go 36,000 out. And tell you what, we'll go 800 here, line it up with that, so we got a loop now. We got a loop of road. Now this is going to be our first zoning area that we're going to make. And I think I'm going to make some industry right here. So we'll build a little bit of a thing right here. And we don't want there to be too many intersections right next to each other. So, just so that nobody can come in this way, they have to do the loop around. We can do like a one-way type of situation. So then they can go in, around, and oh, that doesn't make that much sense actually. Ah, whatever. We're not too worried about congestion right off the bat actually disregard what i just said <laughs> we'll just do that so there's two intersections this will become a bit of a problem later i'm sure when we actually have some industry but who cares right now now that we got that you can see there's some empty space inside here these tiny little squares they're zoning areas this is where we can actually build what we want to do we want to make sure we get to use up as much space as we can. I'll do one road right across here just to make it. Mm, I guess that's all we really need. Yeah. Because then it's one fluid motion, yada yada. So now. We can zone this out. We're going to do a little bit of grid following these small circles here as we do. Oh. Yeah, perfect. Just like that. Building our city in grids. A grid-like fashion. Just like somewhere like Alberta in the plains. Or even the US. US. We'll do we'll do 135 here so it's a nice angle bit. straight shot there you go and connect this up there we got a nice big old grid going on this is what we're going to work with right off the bat Okay. Now that we've got that going on, we can actually start planning for some houses and other things. We need to worry about getting this place power before we build anything. Now there's two ways 
you could get power right off the bat. You could get a coal power plant, or you could get windmill. Coal produces a lot of power, but it also produces pollution. Wind doesn't produce as much, but it doesn't produce any pollution. We are, we are going to build a coal power plant right next to the highway. <laughs> the main highway. Go. Now that's going to be our power source. And we're going to be, want to be able to... We won't need these forever because, you know, we're going to have buildings connecting everything. But for now, we'll need them. Now we want to build some water and plumbing. But we need to get some water over here to over here. We need a pump. Place it right here. Um, I don't want to pollute our rivers too much, so we'll do an inland water treatment plant, and we'll place it right next to the, the power plant. Because we can pretend like it's using it for cooling or whatever. So now we need to connect this first up with our filtration plant. And then... What I like to do is I like to follow the roads just so I know that everything's covered. Because that's kind of what they do in real life, you know, they place all the plumbing and whatnot under the roads. And then we'll go right down the middle here. Make sure we get everything. Out a little bit. And then boom. Boom. We now have plumbing and power. Now, we don't really need this Because we got a circle and we got our roads. Oh. All well and good. Okay. Now we got that going on. We can zone for some things. Now... We want to zone right next to our power so we can actually get power. We will place some houses right here. And we'll do a little bit of a block. This. Houses here. We'll do some convenient stores and whatnot here. It, we don't get to choose what buildings we get. I'm just having fun. But, so, I guess I should explain these. Our first screen is low-density residential. These are houses. Our second, or first blue is low-density de commercial zone. These are, like, restaurants, shops, stores, gas stations, type of thing. And then we have our first yellow, which is industrial zone. This is our industry. This is producing us goods and such. So we'll just make a whole bunch of red, uh, general industry right here. Just because all the pollution is going to be here anyway, we may as well slap it all right there. And we'll separate our residential houses by our industry with some stores. Everybody likes a good store. This um, prevents any noise pollution from our industry leaking over to our um, residential zones. We'll just fill these blocks. Boom, boom, boom. Hey, okay. now we can press play and see how it builds itself. Got power. We got water. People should start moving in because land is cheap right now. You can see our little birdie there telling us things. 
Oh, look, people are building. Check it out. Scaffold. Building the houses. Look at that. That's a house. I sure do think that's a house. It's two houses. It's a duplex. There's another house right here. Big old garage. Like a little bit of an apartment situation going on here. With, with, um, solar panels. I think. They say they don't have electricity. But I know they're going to have electricity in a minute once we build some houses right here and connect it. They just need to wait a second. We just need a house right here. And then our electricity would be connected. Come on. Oh, fine, okay. Connect it right here, I guess. There, now they have electricity. Oh no, I'm losing money. So in this bottom corner here, you can see my weekly income is in the red. It's very much in the red. I am losing money. So we have a lot of funding into our electricity and water right now. There's hardly anybody anybody there, so we can turn this right down. We don't need nearly the amount of money this is producing. Or taking from us, rather. That seems... It's really excessive, really. Now we're going to get some industry. And you can see our debt is going down. We got some businesses popping up. We got Pop Soda, Go Nuts for Donuts, Yaki Soba, Tasty Noodles. <laughs> Can you read that? Yaki Soba, Tasty Noodles, Burgers. What about this little district here? We got a gaming store. We got, um,. What appears to be a convenience store of some kind. And another burger shop. And there's the billboards on top of the building. <laughs> Very cool. We are losing money, but we're slowly not losing it. We just need to wait for our industries to build up. You can see we're starting to get some businesses. There's our water filtration plant. This is our coal plant. This is some industry. Look at that big factory. Very cool. We got a shipping yard. What do they produce? Goods. Box factory. Box factory. Not enough water? What do you mean not enough? Oh, everybody needs water. Okay, now we need to pump up the funding a little bit. Oh, there's no electricity. I forgot. Our pump needs electricity. Okay, we're going to have to pause the game. I think we might need to take out a loan. Can we do that yet? How do I get to the loans? I need a loan. 
Oh, I can't access the loans yet. Okay, that might be a problem. We're in the red. And we have no electricity. This might be a failure right off the bat. <laughs> Oh, no. Okay, well. Look away. I can get to my console. Hold on, I know I want to be cheating, but I want to demonstrate this game, you know. Okay, well, what we'll do is we'll go to options, gameplay, there's a way to enable infinite money, misc. Ah. Okay, well, it looks like the only way we can do this is opening up the tab. Because I don't think we're going to be making any money anytime soon. Yeah, we're already dropping again. Okay, well, so we'll just save. Ignore that. <laughs> um, we'll call it fake city because it's you know it technically died off because we forgot about our water pump needing water power just quit to main menu go to content manager save games uh, mods. Unlimited money. We'll turn that on. Let's load fake city up. So we have infinite money now. <laughs> Just use it to get out of the red and then we'll turn it back off. Because I foregore.
Okay. And we'll just... We'll just extend... Some, uh... Power lines way out here to this guy. And we'll wait once we're out of the red, we'll exit quickly and then enter quickly back in again. And we'll make sure our budget... Yeah, fine. Okay, everybody's happy once more. We're still dropping. Stop it. Why are we still dropping? Is our roads? Do we need to cheap these out too? We don't need much of this money at all. Do I need to raise taxes? I can't yet. We'll build some more houses, how about? Yeah, that'll do it, I'm sure. Okay, we're almost out of the red. Twenty-eight. Eleven. Seven. We are out of the red. Okay. Awesome. We'll save. Save. Then we'll quit. Main menu. And we'll turn infinite money back on. We just needed a little help. Because I'm bad. Bad back. There we go. Oh, load game, fake city, load. Hey, yeah, we went negative 5,000. Damn. We're going to have to wait a minute while we regain that money. But it's fine. It's fine. We just can't expand for a bit. We could just build houses. I think we'll do another, like... Do another little bit of a market right here. With like a corner store. Right here. And then some houses on the inside. Just like that. Finish this out too. I'll bulldoze this. Make this green. Nice, we're getting some commercial. We got industry. We got our houses. Look at these people. Look at them rocking, walking around. Raymond Campbell. He works at the coal power plant. Where's this guy? Bicycle. <laughs> oh, you can also name the roads in this game. This is Cypress Road. This is Wilson Street. This is Beechwood Way. You can also rename the houses and the shops too. 
and even your coal power plant. The power plant. <laughs> the power, the power pant. <laughs> There we go. Ain't that neat? But yeah, so our how our city is looking good. We're making some money now. We're starting to get out of debt. So far, so good. Now we're going to speed up time a little bit, just so we can... Oh, we got an achievement. We are now a little hamlet. We have a population of 500. We unlocked a landfill, an elementary school, and a medical clinic, as well as taxes, loans, and services. So we want to build a dump real fast, because people be making messes. Um, we'll put it right, um, this is going to, um, you know what, we'll, we'll add in another district here. Another gate outwards. And this will just be our dump. The direct access. And we'll eventually, we'll, no, we'll move this. We'll move this inwards so we can actually like put the roads around. And then we also want to build a oh we don't have enough money. Okay, we need it we need to wait a little minute just so we have enough money. Build a hospital and then a school. Because those are both important. And we want to make sure that our hospitals are not on the main road directly that they're like one or two branches off but i think we should upgrade these innermost roads to like proper roads with sidewalks do some upgrading Oh no, I didn't want to upgrade those ones. Looks like people are losing power because we're not generating enough. We'll go to the thing, give it a little bit more funding so it produces more power. Yo. Nice. Looking good. Our houses are starting to look a bit more modern, too. As they upgrade. Look at that big old house right there. And it's nighttime. Okay. Um. Do we. Oh. I upgraded a lot of roads. We used up all of our money. Let's take out a loan. So we can build a hospital and also a educational house. We'll build the school like right here, a bit central. And we'll also build the hospital right across the street from it. Oh, did I just build two schools? <laughs> hospital. There we go. Still properly zoned. There we go. See, now we got... Where is it? Yeah, now we've got a little bit of a hospital. Well, not a hospital. It's a medical clinic. And we got a school. School with a fancy punch buggy. 
for the playground. Yeah. So our population is still getting steadily bigger. And we're making money. Our industry is booming. So things are going well. I don't know if we need these anymore. We don't. Everything's connected now. This blue shows us where our electricity is connected. Now we'll speed up time until we need to build more stuff. Did you see all those people go into that house? What's going on here? There's nine adults in here? Oh, people are starting to need water. Increase the funding a bit. And you know what? We'll also increase the taxes just a smidge. So we make more money off of them. There we go. We're going across a thousand pretty quickly here. And look at the houses, they're getting bigger too. This one's a full apartment, basically. These guys need electricity. How are we doing for electricity? We're just below what we need. We'll increase this just a little bit. 25, perfect. And we're crossing another... We're a village now. We can get um, emergency services, police department, and we've got some more stuff coming along the way. We can make districts and policies and such. So now we'll put the fire hall... We'll make it all centralized. The fire hall will be on the same street as the hospital. And the police street will be right across the street from that. It's all right here in the middle. And we can make this our first district, and we can also make this our first industrial district. So, we'll map it out here. There we go. And they need power, so we'll just we'll just ump the ump the funding a little bit. Just like that. How are we looking? We need a fair bit more power actually. Good. There we go. Now we're cooking. And how are we looking on water? Water is still super available. What do you mean you don't got water? You got water? Liars. Okay. So this is our first district, and we can give it policies like water and power usage. We'll just, we'll, um, we'll make it specific to this one. by selecting it so it doesn't affect our industrial district. And we'll distribute some smoke detectors too so they don't burn down their houses. As it were. I 
took us 40 minutes and we only built out this one tiny section. <laughs> Ain't that crazy? I mean, I'm pretty methodical on how I lay out things. But still. And I think we'll make... We'll make this main road a four-lane road now. Just because it's starting to get a little bit bigger. We have to bulldoze some people's houses, evict them and whatnot, but whatever. All for the sake of making things bigger. Okay, and then we can fill out these gaps. More stuff. More stuff. Yeah, we love stuff. Just like this. Yeah, more stuff. There we go. And we're now going back in the red. Because I just bulldozed a bunch of people's houses. <laughs> uh, and what's our taxes? Way too much funding. Way too much fun. Way too much fun. Schooling can stay the same. And we need more electricity too. No, we don't. What do you mean? What do you mean? Oh, it's not connected anymore. Oh, that would do it. <laughs> we'll just... Oh, we don't have enough money. Just wait for it. We just need to build some buildings up right here. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> I just disconnected my power grid, basically. Come on, build a house right here. That's all we need. Just one house. Just one house right here, please. Just a commercial building. Two. Two of them. Oh dear. Ooh, ooh, there we go. Now it's connected. We got a we got a building. We're connected. Ooh. <laughs> Why are we still looting a buttload of money, though? Let's look at our budget. Income. Oh, our policies are taking a toll on us. So maybe we should turn off those policies. We'll stop distributing. How did that do? It's dropping. It's dropping. How much is it going to drop? Okay, I think. I think we're about to be good. Okay, we're starting to need some more industry, so let's build this out. We can't because we have no money. <laughs> we 
We could take out another loan, but we still have to pay back the other one. And we still have to pay someone. Yeah. Our policy jumped back up a fair bit. Okay, you know what? No more policies. <laughs> There you go. <laughs> Way better. Oh boy. Now we have to wait. When we get out of the negative so we can expand some more. Okay, let's look at our natural resources. Don't got much, actually. Not a whole lot lying around. Once we expand into this, we can build, like, some... I don't know... Forestry stuff? I wonder if we can do, um, got four lane one ways yet. We do not. We got six lane one ways though, funnily enough. No. No. <laughs> Hey, alright, I got distracted there. So now we can expand this industry. Because we don't have any space to speak of right here. We'll extend this out a bit. Build a bit of a cube. Yes. Just like so. build some more industry right here some generic industry you know what it won't be generic we're actually going to do some farmland right here select this and then we'll mark it to be farmland oh wait no it's right next to the dump never mind it won't be farmland it'll be generic Is we don't want to have food growing right next to the farmland. That would be bad. They need water. Of course, of course. Supply them with water. Let's make sure that they have enough ability... Ooh, we're upgrading again. Tiny town. We're tiny town now. We got so much stuff. I'm not going to explain it all. <laughs> oh. Upgrade this road right here. We got three-way three -way, one-lane roads, so we can ex upgrade our main roundabout here.
Well, we unlocked the library and the high school. I think we should build a high school. We got an elementary. We will put it right... Put it right... Um, put it right here. So it gates access. And we also got parks, I think. Where's the park? Parks! There we go. We can build some parks. I think we'll put a park right... Dog park, small playground. Put a little bit of a playground right here. There we go. We got a playground. We'll put a, like a, an adult park right next to it. I can't. Too big. We'll put it right here. Or no, we'll put it um right here. Yeah. Park. Two parks right next to each other. And then another one right here. There we go. Now we're starting to want some more residential and commercial. So we're going to just expand our city. We'll do another four lane road. We can't go out that far. Fast. Speed up time. Why don't you have electricity? Need more funding? Yeah, we need more funding. We're producing more than we can we can come up with in one coal plant power plant. We're right on the cusp. Okay, we should wait. So we can build like some windmills, which are six thousand dollars. And we will put them right here. Something like that. Or should I build another coal power plant? 19,000 though, that's a lot of money. I don't know. These guys don't have workers for whatever reason. Yeah, yeah, okay. I think we maybe bite the bullet and just build another coal power plant. Just because they produce so much power. We are in desperate need of expansion. Why do they... What, what, what's going on here? They need a lot more workers. Yeah, I know, because we don't have enough people. I'm working on it. It will build out one block.
shopping center. Boom. Residential. And then we need to send the plumbing. Boom. More workers. <laughs> that didn't really solve our problem. Well, now we're getting abandoned places. Close those. We need more power. I just want. I just. Okay. We'll hyperfund it. Double. <laughs> uh, we're losing money. We just need to get to 19,000. Please. I don't want to take out another loan unless we paid it off. We have not. We've almost paid it off. Okay, we're almost there. We can build a new electrical plant. Boom. Way more power now. And we can drop that funding way down. Maybe not that low. There we go. Now we're cooking. Damn. Now we can expand properly. Before we do though, I want to make, I want to edit our route so the traffic flows a little better. If you look at it right now, we've got some tough spots building up. Routes. Junction. Just roads. Okay, this guy. Make it. We will prioritize it. Then we'll make the junctions. Ding. We'll make them stop signs. So that people going down the road have to yield to this. That way they have the right of way and they can just zoom down. I don't know if they have the option to do this on the Twitch or the Switch. <laughs> Not Twitch. Um, but if they do, recommend it. Boom, now traffic should flow a little bit better. Okay, and we'll pull out this road just a bit more. Oh, I should do it. And then we'll build out. We don't have enough money. Now we do. Building out our city in blocks, pretty much. Looks like water is becoming an issue. Okay, 
Okay. Water. Yes. Increase its funding a little bit. Perfect. this right here and we'll fill the rest up with residential just like that and then we'll make sure that they have water like so We're starting to fill out the map. Let's check on our houses. We're starting to look pretty good. Look at all those people. Look at a big house. Big house. <gasps> big house. Upgraded. Busy corner shop. Drug store. Very cool. Okay, we have a need for some more commercial. We're going to build a bit of a commercial district. Just like that. Just, just a straight line. We'll just fill it up with commercial. We got, tw we're a booming town now. We unlocked highways and buses and bus lanes and a whole bunch of stuff. And we got $50,000 in government funding. We'll increase the funding to our medical fire hall lease and such. And we'll give this side of town some emergency services. And we'll build a cemetery. Right here. <laughs> I don't think we're going to get to the... To the, uh... Skyscraper parts tonight, buddy. Just because it's really late, like midnight right now, and I don't think I should keep playing. Oh no, oh no, oh no, we need electricity. More funding. Give us electricity. More funding. There we go. We'll end it on a good spot where a house is, or our town is starting to boom. And we'll also name it. Can I name it? We'll name it. What should we name our city? Hmm. 
Think of something funny. Fart. <laughs> there you go. Farts are funny. Hey. A big old highway going down the middle. Goes through. All the way down. There's an abandoned house right here. You need to go. All the way into our industry. To the roundabout. You can see all of the all of those trucks and business ass. Look at all that. Exportation. Very cool. See how well that traffic's managed on a roundabout? Why is this two? This should be three. Whoops. <laughs> That's better. And then we should make this a new district, I guess. Before we go. Bedford Hills. And we'll just make it preempt. That's like Fair. So we got Spring Fair, Square, Bedford Hills, High Heights, and Thornton District. And that's our city so far. So we're going to fill out this square, and then we'll probably expand into another one. Build a bridge across, yada yada. This highway will go right through. It'll be cool. But... That be it for right now. Very cool. Bye.